hello guys and welcome to glorious la my name is rafael and in this tutorial i'll be showing you how to create an e-commerce website with site 123 so site 123 is one of the best website builders we have out there so in this tutorial i'll be showing you how to add products how to create product categories and a whole lot more so in order to not waste our time let's get started so you want to click on start here if you don't have an account with site 123 uh, so since I have my account, so I will just be logging in to my account now So uh, let me do that. I'll see you on the other side. So I've successfully logged into my site 23 account, so I'll be clicking on Create a new website here Okay So we have been hacked here. What type of website do you want? So I'll be creating an online store since we are creating an e-commerce website so i'll put the name of the website i want to create here okay megan store all right then open a website so our website has been created now it shouldn't take long okay fantastic so our congratulation on your new website so one thing about site 23 is that when you try to create a new website they automatically create uh, a pre-made website for you which makes a lot of sense because you don't want to go through the hassle of trying to build from scratch so any beginner can easily build a website with site 23 so what you want to do now is just to change things around just to suit the way you want your website to look i hope that makes sense so the first thing you want to do Okay, if you have a website logo you, you want to add, you can just come up here and click on edit logo. Alright, so, so if you have a logo on your PC or your Mac, what you want to do is click on choose logo here. Then you can just click on upload. Okay. Uh, actually, I don't have an, a logo for the website I'm trying to build. So you can just also just leave the name of your your website as the logo which makes a lot of sense too so that's about it so I want to change this image this background okay I want it to look nicer for an e-commerce website so what I will do is click on template here and look for a fantastic uh, header that would suit an e-commerce website so let's look for one real quick so site123 provides you a lot of templates to choose from so you can just choose any of these okay so i'll choose this which says summer collection is here all right so i think i prefer this one so you want to change the text here what you just want to do is just put your cursor on it and you know delete it i can just put uh welcome to Megan store all right and any text you want to change all you have to do is put your cursor on it really and you know just edit it away you can do the same for the button also if you want to put instead of new collection I can put shop now there all right then I can decide to change the button size to big or huge okay leave it that way and I can also remove this you know this image if I want to do that I'll just click on edit drive my cursor to the image itself and click and you know click on edit so I can decide to put any image you know that works for me upload any image for my PC you know but I don't have an image in particular to put there so i'll just leave this just the way it is all right so i'll leave that okay moving on so as you can see here we have um size one to do already created some you know old uh some products you know these are just products created by the you know by size one two three four us. so what we want to do is we can just delete all these and add our product but I won't be deleting everything, you know. I just want it to just for tutorial purposes. I'll be 
you know adding my products to the ones we have here already so one thing i notice here is that the price are set to uh naira, naira the currency is set to naira so i want us to change it to us dollars so to change that you can just click on edit the product so we come to this e-commerce tab and we can just go to settings all right we can go to payment method then we can change main currency to usd okay all right then we can just save it all right update successful nice so fantastic so that's it we have our price in us dollars now so i will be, if you want to delete any of the products here okay you just you see the trash icon by the side of the edit you can just delete it are you sure yes you can just delete it okay looks good then we can add our products so to add our products now what you want to do is come to products okay then we can add new products here so i have a product you and hand, i have a handbag i would like to add as a product on our, our website so let me add it real quick uh the product name is uh outdoor women whatever you know i got this product on amazon so let me add that so we can just paste it here that's the product name all right then i have the short description for the product itself I have it here I believe the best thing for you to do when you are trying to build a website is to have all you know all every details saved somewhere so you can just copy and paste it it really makes your work easy so i will just put that here real quick all right and i can decide to put the product into any of the categories so the categories we have here we have the women category and the men category so since it's a woman's bag i'll just put women put it under the women category also you can decide to add more categories if you want to you can all you have to do is just click this okay add new category here all right then you can just put the category you want you can decide to put shoes as a new category then you just click on add all right but i don't want to add it because you know i'm not putting it in the shoe category so i'll just untick that and leave it in the women's category only so you can set the price uh let's say the bag cost you know 150 dollars quite an expensive bag though if you'd ask me uh so so that's it and we can just put the sale price on 120 all right and uh that's it so we can go to options here Okay, we can save it first. I mean, we don't have to save it. Okay, yeah, we need to add our product image here. So you just have to choose image, then upload. Click on upload, then we go to, you know, our PC to upload the bag image. I mean, you can add a lot of image images about on the bag. So I have quite a few images here to add. Let me add some more. Okay. okay looks good yes so I've added our images so you can move to the next options so the product option now if you have your product in different varieties so this is where you you know you put it so the the handbag we have it in two different colors we have it on black okay we have it on black And brown so I'll just delete the blue take it off okay since we have brown so it's best we just change this red color to brown okay yeah okay let's just leave it up at that then black I'll just put it up black here as you can see, I mean, Site123 is quite easy to use, so you just click on Update, right, 
and you can add different uh, option if your product options you know depending on the kind of the product you are trying to sell you know if it's a product where size is a thing probably it's a cloth or whatever you can just put size you know small medium large or whatever you know you can add it that way but we don't need it for in the case of this bag so i'll delete that so the next thing is to add attributes product attributes you know yeah it's about the material of the product the shape and all of those things so you know i think i have a, something in relation to that here so we have product dimensions pro I, product item and all of those things so i'll copy this i can just paste it here yes you know whatever so moving on you can just move to the shipping you know you can decide to make it free shipping whatever you know or if it doesn't involve shipping if you are selling a digital product and you know so you can just add your the weight and dimension of the product here so it will easily calculate the cost of shipping but in this case i won't be doing that so I just leave it leave that then move to inventory you know um if the product is in stock i really don't like to mess with this inventory because you know you might be selling your product and or one of these days you your it just go out of stock you know it's not something i, I like to mess with i like to uh, change it manually myself so i'll leave that so related products if you want to automatically get that done I, I i would rather have you leave it you know on auto you want the system to you know automatically come up with that for you so it makes sense that way so what you want to do now is just uh, save it okay now it looks good so we have a bag there as one of our products and if you hover on it you can you know it shifts to another product and which looks good okay we can have the quick view which will show us you know the details of the product easily and we can easily see what it's about and all of those things okay there's one thing i feel to do uh let's edit it let's go to edit and the options i think i would like to upload the black bag itself the black version of the bag okay and upload the brown so when anyone clicks on it you know it just appears like that then i'll save it okay let me check it out now so the black the brown yeah makes a lot of sense so our customers can easily have to cut and you know happy shopping yeah that's it yeah okay and uh what else we can decide to have you know more categories if we want so to have more categories you can just click on edit so we have women we have men we can add one more category if we want so we can just say bags then we can click on add yeah that's it then we can edit it put the descriptions whatever i want to put there so that's really how to add another category okay i think it's best we just put an image there let's just put the bag image there okay let's get in you know, so uh, site 23 provides you with their image library you know so you can just look for a bag image here so you don't some most times you don't even need to you know go to add this uh, your own image you can easily get image because it has been you know uh, there's a way it has been come match connected with on splash so it can have you have tons of image to work with so that makes a lot of sense makes your work easier but of course you'd have image you took you know, for your product yourself so you can add that so um, that's it then we can just leave it 
Yeah, so we have it there, bags. So we have the three categories, women, men, bags. So now that we have our, our categories here and we have it up here, so you know, our customers can easily click on the menu here to go to the categories they want to shop in. So that's about it. And you can have uh, your about page here. This is your about section easily. So you can just edit this part you know, and put whatever you want to add here. So that's about it really. So, so when you're done, when everything looks good to you, you can easily come here and publish it. So our website has been published successfully. Now what you want to do is um, buy, get a domain name for our store, meganstore.com. Let's see if that's available. Okay, that's not available. So we can easily make a clothing store. Let's try that. Meganclothingstore.com. Okay, that's available. So if the domain name you're trying to buy is available now, you can just click on available. So you'll be prompted to choose any of the plans, the gold plan, the professional, advanced, and basic. So it's best you go for the professional plan because it covers a business website and the story so you can easily you know work with that so that costs several about 18 dollars monthly all right and most of the time sites one to three come up with discounts and all of that so it helps you and with this you can easily process about 500 dollars uh, i mean pardon me about 500 orders monthly okay and you have a lot of you know amazing options to work with so this is like this is the best plan you can go with the professional plan so you can select it pay and you are good to go so that's about it for this tutorial guys i hope you find it helpful uh, if you have any question you can drop it in the comment section below and i appreciate you subscribing to this channel thank you very much have a nice time peace